Hello, redesigners, and well, welcome to an unusual view <laughs> from our front door to the picnic table. Today, Gary, well, kind of mixed emotions. We're leaving Hollister, Missouri. Yeah. We're currently, right now, at this moment, all hooked up, ready to depart Turkey Creek RV Park or Village, depending on the signage, which is part of the Escapees network of campgrounds. Mm -hmm. What an amazing place. I think we paid like 26 bucks a night because we're Escapees members, because why wouldn't you be? We ain't gonna have time to do a full-on review of this place. But uh, as Carrie had mentioned earlier in the uh, off-camera segment, if you want to know about an RV park that we haven't mentioned in a video, you can always check us out on RV Life Pro. We're not sponsored. We just happen to do reviews there for our own records, but we share with the public. You can check us with life redesign there. Make it real simple. Now, you can see why smiles is so smiles. We're excited about our next stop. Now, those of you who've been around the channel know that we've been for years planning on going to Texas. Three years we've waited <laughs> to go to Texas. Yeah. And it's finally coming true. And more importantly than that, it's my 50th birthday celebration <laughs> week. Well, you're a baby still. <laughs> We're going into a whole new, it might even be the month of Bob. Oh. But anyhow, stick with us. We're going to show you what we might have found is a great overnight camping spot for free with hookups. What? Whoa. Hopefully this materializes. We're a little nervous about it, but we're going to share whatever the drama is with you. Yep. And then at the end of this video, yep. you're going to see our three year, wait, come true as we head into Lake Texoma, yep. part of the Thousand Trails. But more importantly, it's going to be in Texas. I Sparkles know. here and gets to earn a whole new sticker. Uh oh If you know, you know. We'll catch <laughs> you in Oklahoma. It's the next day. In fact, it is a late start for us. It is roughly about 9.45 in the morning. That's how quiet it was here in Roland, Oklahoma at the casino. Now, Carrie and I did go inside last night, and well, we lost big. How much did we lose, Carrie? Nineteen ninety-five. And no, that's not nineteen hundred and ninety-five dollars. That's nineteen dollars and ninety-five cents. We have yep. a twenty-dollar limit now on casinos, but I mean, if you look at it just from the standpoint, if you were Harvest host, I believe they're up to thirty dollars, and you don't even get hookups. Here, it was all free hookups. We didn't even have to go inside if we didn't want to. But we did. It's a nice small casino, and it is small. The only downside, of course, is that smoking, and it's in the south. Smoking here is like, it was like burning your eyes bad. But, uh, you know, hey, and people like to smoke, I guess. I don't know. But uh, speaking of smoking, that's the only other thing about this place that was really bad. Here, we're trying to give you a nice little shot. There's some people who have been ripping some cigarettes outside this place for a while now, and they just throw them down. So if you ever happen to be in one of these places and you smoke pick your cigarette butts up will you come on now but uh you know nice now keep in mind this was crazy last night we had severe thunderstorms i think i lost carrie there all she is night. severe thunderstorms all night with potentials for flash floods and the whole night and uh so we're a little bit muddy here but let me tell you i've stayed in some high-end resorts mm -hmm. that uh that was waiting outside our door or the person who's driven up on the lawn and uh, created all those ruts well that's enough of that we are ready we're heading to texas we are now getting ready to go yeah you ready four hours Come we'll on. see you in a few All right, <laughs> we made it to Texas, y'all. How about this? If you like, if you've been around the channel for any amount of time, yeah. holy cow, we've been trying to get to Texas for at least three years, and finally, we're here at our first thousand trails in Texas, and we're here in oh, we're here. Where are we? We're at Lake Texoma, Texoma in Gordonsville, Texas. Now we're gonna have a full review on this park probably in the next video next couple of videos it, it will be out there we've just got done filming but we wanted to pop in here because we're only here for a couple of nights but we wanted to share this with you this place is drop dead quiet 
it, it's just been amazing. Everything that I thought of Texas from watching Dallas with JR, remember who <laughs> shot him? Anyhow, all the times that I've seen anything in Texas, this is what I pictured. And to be here on a thousand trails property of all things and seeing exactly what I pictured, I'm gonna be 50 years old tomorrow. Let me share this with you. I'm gonna be 50 years old tomorrow. By the time this comes out, I'm already 50 and I'm already old. <laughs> But I am still like a kid whenever we get to a new place because this country is amazing. And to see something like this with it, and I'm, I'm hoping the camera picks it up, anything that we've ever picked on any YouTuber for doing the same old, same old thing of going to the, you know, the 90th, millionth Bucky's opening and uh, all going to, I can't even think right now, all the same places, doing all the same videos. This is what drives us nuts. This is why we do what we do, because this is part of our Thousand Trails membership. This is free. This is not sensationalized RV life, folks. This is just real life, and I'm over the moon excited <laughs> to be here. Carrie and I have walked this beach, and I'm gonna show you this beach here. We walked all this beach. Carrie and I walked all this beach in dead quiet. Mm -hmm. There's nobody here. There's no reason to sensationalize RV life. This is it. And now we're all, I'm going to throw some video overlay here just to show you our site. And again, a full video about Thousand Trails Lake Texoma, along with some more changes yeah, to surprise. Thousand Trails, uh, will be in that video. But for you guys just in this, that enjoy these vlog style videos, this is what life's all about is just walking these paths you don't need to be out there checking out all the tourist traps you don't need to be doing all the craziness and you don't need to over sensationalize your life when you have this kind of beauty in nature it's absolutely incredible and i'm, I'm still i couldn't think of a better way to spend my last day in my 40s as we continue onward to texas especially with the special gal pal here now We've got some exciting things coming up. We are heading next to Thousand Trails Lake, Lake Whitney. Yep. Now, we, I think Lake Whitney's dried up. I could be wrong. I'm so excited. I don't even remember where we're going next. <laughs> but we are heading into, from there, we're going to head into Waco, Texas. We're going to check out yes. the Magnolia Silos. We're going to try to film for you guys because, again, this is like a big thing for us. It may not be for you, but it's a big thing for us to be able to do <laughs> that. It's a big deal. We want to check out, speaking of RVers who film every, the same thing over and over again, we want to check out the Dr. Pepper Museum, but we probably won't film that. Maybe we will. Who knows? But uh, that's in Waco. There's all sorts of things coming up. We want to go into Dallas. But we're only there for we're only in Lake Whitney for four days, so we got to get through that, and then we're going into Medina Lake, yep. and then we're in Lake Conroe. We've got some amazing things coming up in Texas, so stick around. If you're yep. really nice, we're going to bring you along with us in the morning. Should we? Ooh, well, we could. All right, you behave yourself. We'll <laughs> check in tomorrow. Now we're here, as you can see, we're hooked up. We've got the cameras up. Not because we're so much sketched out about the park itself, because the park is, oh my God, it's beautiful. It's everything we thought Texas was gonna be in more. But we put the cameras up because as you can see, there's really nobody, I'm gonna give you, without making you too dizzy, there's hardly anybody here. And part of it, now we have a couple of annual sites over there. Part of it could be the fact that it's 90 something degrees, as you can tell by the sweat that's beating off of me. The other part is, it's quite, you know, early in the week. It's only Tuesday. Full hookup sites. We did talk to the management here, and wow, are they doing some major, major improvements here. All kinds of new electrical going in. In fact, over here, this was crazy. This here, this site, is all brand new electrical. All brand new 50 amp service. We don't need 50 amp, but this is what was available. And the sewer is perfect. The water's fantastic here. Good pressure. Hell, I didn't even need to deploy Starlink because T-Mobile got an excellent service right off the bat. That is amazing. Just really incredible. Nice place for home for us for the next four nights as we venture out into Waco. But if you're in Texas, this place is definitely worth checking out as long as you understand that they are aware of what needs to be done and they're addressing it at a rapid pace. In fact, some new blood in the office, as we've said before, can make an amazing mm -hmm. difference 
as far as an RV park goes. And it seems like after talking to the gentleman there, he's on the right track and he knows what he's doing. But yeah, look at this. Now you have some of the roads inside they're still working on, as you can see. Some of this stuff here, you know, where it wears down, whatever. But yeah, not too, uh, not too bad at all. In fact, this here, the broken uh, asphalt pad at one time has all been replaced with fresh gravel. I really can't ask for much more. This is fantastic. But we'll try to do a full review from here. Don't know if it's going to happen, but we'll try to get that out. But uh, that's pretty much it. We have some birthday celebrations to do. Carrie still needs to earn that Texas sticker. If you know, you know. And uh, <laughs> we have to get ready to go to Waco in the morning. Mm -hmm. So until next time, I am Bob. I'm Carrie. And thank you for watching the vlog. And uh, remember, wherever you are in life, remember if the situation isn't what you want it to be. Remember the universe shall provide. And that will help you redesign your life. Ready? Ready. Bye.